Hey guys, it's MC Fix It here. We're going to be working on replacing a drive belt or a serpentine belt on a Honda Odyssey 2011 through 2017. Here are the tools and the supplies for this vehicle. Uh, one of those serpentine belt kits work really well and it uses a 14 millimeter on it. Um, this is one option for the belt. I'll put some others down in the description below. And we also use, this is just a long pry bar that we use the belt and when we are holding it up against the crankshaft just to kind of give it some pressure because it's so far down in the engine bay. So go ahead and get a 14 millimeter with the extension for the serpentine belt and you're going to go down and you're going to look for the tensioner pulley and once you've located that you're going to go ahead and take it and pull it up and begin to weed all of the uh, belt out of all of the different pulleys until you've completely pulled every bit of the belt out of the engine bay sometimes it does get stuck so just wiggle it around until the whole thing does come out the next step is to compare the belts and even look at your old one and see how bad it is this one's not too bad but we did get this new one and it'll last about 100,000 miles. So you can go ahead and remove your tool. And then we will need some light. We are kind of under some covers because it is very, very hot in where we're at today. And so you're gonna go ahead and put this around your crankshaft. So if you have somebody with small hands, this does help. You can also take off your access panel and, and turn your steering wheel, and I believe you should be able to get to it, but we're going to try to avoid that today. And then you got to get it around your AC. I can help. And you can also get like a long tool like this that's more for a pry bar. We're not going to pry bar, but it will help kind of keep everything in place. So we'll put that up on the crankshaft. Then you're gonna come here and around the tensioner. Then you're gonna get all of the extra feed out and over. So you wanna make sure it's all wrapped around correctly and follow the diagram. And then you're gonna to wanna to kinda of hold this back here with like one finger go ahead and grab your tool this is that 14 millimeter again and go ahead and push it towards the front of the car be careful with your power steering line there actually hold on so okay go ahead and push that forward and begin to wrap that around I'm gonna try to get the bottom first and then come up to the top and you are on and so we're going to go ahead and remove our two tools and go ahead and fire that up you do want to check to make sure it looks good and that does and so we'll go ahead and start the car so we're going to go ahead and test the car and so we'll go ahead and start it and everything started just how it should and you can see that belt is spinning nicely it does have that riding on it that you can see that's white that's spinning around if you do hear any squealing or anything like that make sure everything is lined up properly please be safe but thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you have a great day